in the name of Christ. I forgive you. Cornelius, God has looked kindly on your sorrow and repentance. Send men to Joppa and find a man called Peter, who is staying with Simon and Tanner near the sea. Peter, these are looked upon as unclean. But do not call anything impure that God has cleansed. Three men downstairs. They have come for you. Go with them. Don't be afraid, because I have sent them. Peter. There are men downstairs. <laughs> Why are you smiling? Peter. I am. I had a... I'm not, I'm not sure what I should call it, not a dream. I was awake, but... I was visited. By... I know, I know not what. An angel. And, and I heard your name. I have been a witness and party to many terrible deeds. Truth. What is truth? Now the men. I saw your Jesus die. This is his mother. So, spare her this. You can see he's dead. I'll be the judge of that. There's no need for this. Please. The order is to make sure. Cornelius, I have a certain matter only you can clear up. If I can, of course. I need to know one thing from you. When he was placed inside his tomb, are you certain the Nazarene was dead? Sir, when I'm instructed to do a job, I do it. I was instructed to ensure the death of the Nazarene on the cross, and that's what I did. He expired before you. Better than that. He expired because of me. And you performed the proofs of death? I instructed Longinus to insert his spear hard between the Nazarene's ribs. And he was dead? Before and after the spear. So, to anyone who might entertain the notion that he might not be dead, that the Nazarene might actually somehow have remained alive after all of what you've just described, you would say what? I would say they were either mad or a fool. Thank you, Cornelius. You may go. And these hands, my mind, 
my heart. A scream's enough. My friend Joanna. How is she? All enemies of Rome are punished and crushed. None are spared. For the glory of our Emperor. Stand up. Don't kneel before me. I'm just a man. Like you. What has he told you? What has God told me? I'm not sure. I'm just a fisherman. But I've been commanded to preach his message to the ends of the earth. And now I see that you may also find the salvation that Jesus offers. So if I am to do this, then I must welcome you and baptize you. Abana la di fi sama li yuqaddasa ismuk li yati malakutuk li takun mashi'ataka fi sama e kama fi al-ard. Abana la di fi sama. Yuqaddash imu. Yuqaddash imu. Yuqaddash imu. Yuqaddash imu. This is why we came. This is our mission. <laughs> Please stay with us for a few more days. We're all eager to hear more of Jesus' words. <laughs> I don't think this little one will let me go. <laughs> I can't let you go either. I feel so alive. My skin prickles with it. I'm... I wish I had the words. I'm... I feel full. Full up. Ready to burst. Centurion. What is it? Now, you can speak. You'll need it back in Jerusalem. Urgently. Because? The statue of our Emperor has arrived. The Governor has ordered you to ensure its safe passage to the Temple. Thank you. Um, I, I must go back. We must, too. You can't do it. No, I can't, but I'm a Roman and a soldier with orders. You have been baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. Yes, but I'm still a soldier. So what will you do? I will... I will pray that the Holy Spirit will guide me. <laughs> <laughs> 